Okay, today I show you how to create this uh, table with the Laravel 5.5 is uh, with the install npm. Okay, so before when we use the npm, you can see the compass uh, Laravel image. Okay, this is the introduction Laravel image that is uh, we use the Node.js and the npm. Okay. So when before we install the data table using the npm you can download the node.js version h.5 current test yes it downloads already you can set up here Okay, we install it. You can check the node version. Yes, version H and the node and the npm version. If you check doesn't so for, not also for you mean that you cannot yet install the Node.js in your computer. Yes. Right now you can go to the how to install is yes Laravel image the npm install so you can go to the Laravel package okay you can change the in the Laravel package folder like this you can see version H npm version 5.3 the Laravel image is a package.json mean that the only remaining step is install Laravel image within a fresh installation of Laravel the rules of directory structure default package.json file you can see the package.json okay this is the new dependency actually bootstrap SAS, cross E and V, jQuery, Laravel image, Lodash, Vo. Okay, right now I want to the install the npm. You can go to Laravel page and press enter. This is a bit that install the node module into the Laravel page. Then you can see when I install, create uh, folder automatically is node module yes right now this is the download team from the website Okay, so right now they install uh, successfully the node module. You can see the folders. Yes, you can see the many folders. Okay, so 
Right now you can go to the laravel.com and you can see how to run which web page web page web page is on. Just before when you write the code in the apps, when you see in the uh, Laravel image, you can run the npm use. Okay, so you can watch a set for change. You can use like this. This is the first I see, which that's in the file in the app dot less. Okay, as you can see you see the source stylus plan cs and the source maps work with the JavaScript. You can see the mesh dot cs that is the files in the web page dot mesh dot cs. Yeah, as you can see. This is the source run from the app.cs in the resource asset. So as you can see the app.cs. This is the public CS you can see in the CS. Okay, so right now I go to the install. Yes, I installed the data board then uh, install here. Okay, so you can go to the uh, Webs, or you can write like this. Yeah, I install the call library. Let's enter. Yes, install this so you can see the package.json at the dependency data table.net version like this. Okay, you can see the data table.net at it. This so you can see in the module, you can see the data table. Okay, you can scroll down and you can lose the data about the nets okay this is the package json this is the check for the data about dot cs that i install yes right now i want to install the styling yes when we do the data about you can must install the data about the net to this okay go to use and press enter. Okay, you can see the package on you can see dependency tools first data antibot.net and the second tools beta antibot.net.tds yes in the under the table data antibot.net you can see the data antibot.net substrate to the data install okay this is the cs and this is the image short cost image that we use the data antibot Yes, when we install early like this, so I want to create use to show the, for example, the data ball. Okay, then I want to create. So I copy here. Yes. 
Okay, right now I want to test, so I want you to copy from this website. Okay, I go to the route web. Yes, okay, I'll create the controller. Okay, go to the the data bar and create a function okay, change it by here Okay, you can see the table that I created, but there is no display with the data table. So, how to create the data table? So, you can go to resource asset and you can see the apps. Right now, I want to import. From Courage and pause. Okay, when we import the query, so you can go to the Node.js. And I want to import. Data's table dot net. Okay, you can visualize. Okay, if you don't run, you can go juice and run with the this when we write code. We run with which and we have run the use. Okay. Okay, right now you come past successfully, so you can uh, refresh. And then that's I want to the copy record here. Okay, you can see the like this.
yes when before we run the in touch you must run the you must run npm run you before we run the as a page here yes if you run and don't show the data to Bob as a, you run the command I show you yes. right now I want to the show it from the database And when I go to the copies, Okay, so run I run again. Plus. Okay. Use. Okay, so I, I delete here. So you can use the ID here, no plus, because this ID table. Okay, so right now I've just uh, finished this lesson how to use the data table. And the next time, still to read, I show you how to import the data to Excel as a PDF and CSV, which are from the data table. Okay, so, uh, how to install the NPM to export data here. Okay, right now I allow you to subscribe, like, and share on my video. Okay, say goodbye.